the genetics of emotions. <laughs> yeah, you probably didn't think that emotions had a genetic structure, did you? <laughs> well, check it out. The genetics of emotions. Emotional patterns flow through the atoms of my genetics, but that doesn't mean that my atoms live through affection. Living in a paradigm of mental incarceration, the molecules of my lifestyle bleed ancient education. So I can't be genetically inferior because melanin is the pigment for the skin color's exterior. Most females get confused with monogamy. Negative dopamine levels in the brain causes emotional ideology. Genetically engineered from astronomical interpretation, my ancestral descendants came from constellations. I have to be genetically attached to observation because most doctrines are regulated by egotistic imagination. The frequency of emotions are wired to radiation. Electromagnetic fields give specification for human behavior adoration. I've been a spiritual being under these seven chakras. I research so much because knowledge is my doctor. Everything is energy, genetically meditated from the Kundalini. Maybe that's too ancient for most pineal glands who are controlled by light codes of DNA. Once you've confused the amino acid structure, those 64 genetic codes get alleviated from the body. Your consciousness is the genetic structure of energy. Our planet is a mystery, just look up the symmetry. The genetics of emotions causes belief. Evidence is the genetics for information. Emotionally connected to positive energy. Genetically connected to wisdom. My mind is not in a prison. Man is a star bound to a body. As a star, I'm genetically affected by another star's psychology. So what's the true genetics of emotions? The genetics of emotions. The genetics of emotions. The genetics of emotions. Yes, our emotions has a genetic structure. Just look at the amino acids of the thoughts that you inhabit every day. Those amino acids can be alleviated through positive energy. The genetics of emotions. The artistic human, Travis Harmon Smith.